up oh, here. <laughs> Hello, my beautiful people welcome to my channel my name is Natalia and this video I will be showing you some photos and small videos um, of my OPK and pregnancy test for this month so without further ado let's go ahead and get into it As you can see this is not my month once again so this makes cycle number four yeah number four of tracking and four years of trying to conceive and it's so hard to not ask yourself a million and one questions and it's like am i broken what is wrong with me uh, why can't I get pregnant again and will it ever happen? And I'm pretty sure that these are questions that any trying to conceive mom has asked herself every time she saw that negative. And it's just like a piece of you just gets ripped out every single time. So like it's just it's hard. It's hard to do those tests. Um, it's hard for me as well. Like I know I already have a kid. I get that. <laughs> but with my 12 year old son it was not planned and it was so easy to get pregnant like it was scary easy <laughs> but don't get me wrong i do i love my son he's everything to me but you just i just can't help but to think you know i was in a crappy relationship <laughs> i was young i was so young i was still in school still living with my parents didn't have a job i didn't have anything to my name there was yeah, nothing and I got pregnant so so easily and now I'm married I'm happy I'm in love I'm st I'm stable I'm more mature and it's something that I really really want and it, it yep yeah, I just can't get pregnant and it just feels so unfair it feels like life is <laughs> playing a cruel joke on me and it, it just really, really hurts. And it's hard to keep the positive, sorry about that, I was making a paper. It's hard to keep a positive mentality when trying to conceive. I'm, don't get me wrong, I know I should be extremely happy for having at least one, and I am. I really, really am, I do, I love my son. And at least I do have one. I mean, I know there are women out there that can't even have that and my heart goes out to them and it, I, I can't, I could just imagine. But I do want to give my son a sibling and I want to give my husband the one thing that he's been wanting his entire life and that's a baby. And of course there's me, I, I've always wanted a big family. And it's like, I feel like I'm at a standstill and it just hurts, it hurts every time I see that pregnancy test. Life goes the way it's supposed to go, right? I mean, I'm not gonna lose hope. Um, I will keep trying and I will do everything I possibly can to get this one thing that I, we all want and that's a baby. Um, 
I am currently uh, cycle day three, so I'm on my period now, yay. And then my app says that I'm supposed to ovulate on cycle day 13, which is about right. I always ovulate around 13, 14, but taking the OPKs, like I have, I don't think I've really got a very, very strong positive. Um, I'm now doing digitals as well, so we'll see. So let's just go ahead and see, fingers crossed. <laughs> and I just, I just need to keep a good mentality. I, I have to keep my head screwed on correctly um or you'll just go crazy i mean you dig yourself into a hole that you can never come out of and that's not what i want i'm happy with my life i really really am i love my marriage i love my family i just want to make it grow bigger <laughs> so yeah i will definitely keep you guys updated and if you would like to see what i'm using on a monthly basis or what i might be doing something if i'm doing anything different leave a comment below and i will definitely upload a video on all the things that i am using or that i'm doing differently uh, don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss anything and hit that thumbs up for me thank you so much for watching and baby dust to all the ttc mommies and i hope to see you on the next one